Well, very excited here. My first look at 2324 hockey. This is series one. Let's see what we get. So we have six packs and this rookie class pack that came in. So I guess it's six and a bonus pack. So we will start with um, our first pack. This is series one. And let's see what young guns we get. We can get uh, some rainbow parallel stuff like that on a roll, all that good stuff. So let's take a look. This is my first look at the product. Look at that. That is, I like it. There's the back. The back is kind of the same that it always been. So yeah, there we go. Gonna go slow at the beginning so we can take a look at uh, at all these nice nice cards there we go we always get these horizontal ones okay here we go we got a quinn hughes glossy opichi version okay this is uh, another one that i had read the 200 by 85 which is the i guess the size of the rink tyler toe foley nice Hey, you the portraits, Shane Wright. That is kind of sick. Okay. And I assume from here on down, it's going to be just a regular base. Lindstrom. And there we go. Let's go now on this side. Pack number two. All right, all right, I'm liking it. So I got this, um, what is it like? Uh, well, the box, I got it at Target. I think it was like f 40 bucks, I think. A Kobe Tar. Oh, this is the first one that starts. Okay, something behind this. Am I upside down? Maybe, maybe. There we go. Okay, again. So yeah, I got it at Target. I saw that uh, it was a few weeks ago. And then I have not seen any more there. So that did kind of go real quick. And, oh, here we have our Star Surge foil. That is nice. Look at that. Like a rainbow, a rainbow foil type. That is a beautiful looking card. Look at that. Right. Deb debut dates. Look. Luke Hughes. And we got an honor roll. Clayton Keller. So these you can actually get a. An exclusive rainbow honor roll. One per boxes and this this doesn't no this doesn't look like any rainbow. Okay, we get our first young guns. This is the look. My first look at young guns, Elliot Denoyer for the Flyers. Nice, put that one here to the side. Okay, so we got our first look at the young guns. I like it. I think young guns always looks good. It's almost always the same um it's based on the same design but with a tweak here there third pack but um yeah no they 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 are they always look good mm -mm -mm. okay upside down again Matt Benning, but they always look good. Upper Deck, I love Upper Deck. I wish they uh, were involved in other sports because that used to be, for basketball, used to be my favorite uh, company was Upper Deck. Still, they do a very good job with hockey and some other products, but hopefully they they could. I wish 
get into uh, other sports. And here come our inserts, another glossy Ridley Gregg for the Senators. Let's see what else we got here. Okay, this is a rookie retrospective. Piter Kachetkov. That is a nice looking card. I like that design. Well, I would open series one and two in the past. I never got anything like this. I wonder if this is a new insert. And a another honor roll of Nathan McKinnon. All right, nice. And then we go with our other guys. They are really kind of glossy. They're really uh, slippery. I love it. Love that design. Pack number four. Let's get it. Okay, so at least from what I can see, each pack has um, has three inserts. And uh, in the one that we got the young gun, the young gun was like the fourth. So let's see if the trend continues, which I'm sure it will. Every pack has had at least three inserts. Van Vancheck, Logan Couture. Here we go. These glossy seem to be quite prevalent. Marco Casper. I wonder if there is a parallel of each one that you can get like a glossy in a different color. Okay, the 200 by 85 with Ovechkin, I like that. That looks nice. Another portrait. These are so cool. And we get another, oh, no young gun there. And then we go through our base. I love that green. That is nice, strong. Number five, so as you can see, it's 12 cards per pack here in this uh, mega box. As I said, I got the mega box. There we go. Got it at Target. I believe it was $39.99. But that was like two or three weeks ago. And I've gone back to see, well, I didn't go to see if there were more because I hadn't opened it yet, but I went just to, to check what was there and nothing else. So they went kind of quick. They also had blasters, but I always buy blasters. So I decided to go with a mega box this time to see if I get anything interesting. Here we go. Another honor roll. So the honor rolls and the Opichi glossy ones seem to be the more common in each pack. Okay, this is our first upper deck canvas of Kent Johnson. Okay, we got a checklist there, but there's the back of the canvas. And we have a series one checklist. I don't know why checklists are always kind of cool to get. And there are the checklists. There are the people on it. So I think, I believe there's no Connor Bedard in series one. I know there's like a secret or super rare or something of Connor Bedard that could pop up, but I don't know if that's like uh, in hobby packs only, or if you could get it here. I did see it, but he will be in series two. And of course that one, that's the one everyone's waiting for. That young gun of Connor Bedard. I wonder uh, how much it'll go for. But that one is about to come out, I think. I think. I believe it's now at the end of March. I don't know. If series two comes out. I've seen it online for the pre-sale. I might try and see if I can get me, maybe get me like a 
a mega box or something at pre-sale, but we'll see how, what the price is. But from what I can see, there's not that many young guns. I've opened blasters where I've gotten three young guns. Here in this mega box, we've only gotten one. Okay, there we go. We got a blue Dazzlers. Oh, but I have a... Oh, okay. There we go. There we see that nice Dazzler effect. I think the green ones are the more rare ones. So this is our first Dazzler. Andre Burakovsky. Oh, all right. There we go. A special. Let's just see the back of the Dazzler. Nothing special there. But Dazzlers... Depending on which one you get, they can be numbered or anything like that, I believe, but they're just so beautiful. That's another one. I think in the past I got more Dazzlers per blaster than what I've gotten here. Only one, and this special edition of Ridley Greig, which I got him already in something else. I think I got him in the in the Glossy Opeachy, was it? I can't remember. There we go, special edition. Also the first one I get. I like that uh that holographic effect. And our other one is a stat box, stat box fillers of Brady Kachuk. Don't know how it's pronounced. Chak Kachuk, I think it is. Anyone you can correct me. And here we go. Ask and shall receive Aiden McDonald in the Young Guns. Okay, so we got two Young Guns in the uh, Mega Box. So I guess they're not... Maybe they're rare this year? I wonder if they made them more rare because of... Uh, because of Bedard coming out on it? I don't know. I kind of like it, though. I like Young Guns to not be as prevalent... As they used to, maybe the value will go up a little bit. And now, this is the last one, which is the rookie class. Three cards. Apparently, there is 15 regular and red parallel cards. So let's see what we get. If there's no Bedard, hopefully we get whoever is just as good as him. Well, maybe not. As good as him, but uh, maybe someone who's also trending in the right direction. Here we go. Simon Ed Edvinson. Next to him is Cole Gutman. Or Gutman. And I guess this is one of those red ones. Marco Casper. There we go. Those were the three rookies. All right. So I'm just going to go over... All the inserts that we got. There you go. We got a Dazzler. The canvas. There you go. I'm just going to go through them so you can see what the different variety that you can get in Series 1. Some nice looking ones. On a roll, you can get the rainbow one. We didn't get and lucky on that one. Mm -hmm. Debut dates, this nice foil one. There we go. Use. And we can't leave out our two uh, young guns. So there you go, guys. That was our, at least my first look at Series 1 2023 hockey. Um, it was that uh, mega box back there. So, um, Nothing too crazy, no autographs, nothing uh, numbered or anything, but I always love opening my hockey uh, products, so maybe next time, and we'll keep an eye out for Series 2 when it comes out, and that's when we'll have a shot at um, Connor Bedard. So I hope you liked it, guys. Consider subscribing. See you next time.